Hello, guys, and welcome back again. I'm here today with Democracy 3 Africa. This is a game in the Democracy series, which is a series of political simulators. Uh, this one is a special edition focusing just on a variety of nations in Africa. Um, you can play as 10 different nations in Africa, specifically Mauritius, Ghana, Botswana, Zambia, Tunisia, Kenya, South Africa, Egypt, Senegal, and Nigeria. So you get a very wide assortment of African nations ranging from fairly well-developed nations like uh, Tunisia to ones with very unique problems like uh, maybe Egypt or Botswana or Zambia to ones that are quite uh, poor like uh, Senegal. And there's a lot of variety in this game. I, I tend to prefer this one over the basic uh, Democracy 3, though Democracy 3 with all of the additions and also Democracy 4 um, is a little bit more, has a little bit more depth as a game. Uh, Democracy 3 Africa is kind of lacking a lot of the things that were uh, added in the add-ons later for both Democracy 4 and Democracy mm -hmm. 3. But I quite like the setting of this. I find it more interesting to rule a nation that has you know, significant problems rather than a nation that's already doing quite well and you really don't have to do much to make it continue doing well. Before continuing on with the video, I'd like to mention that I now have memberships available on this channel. So if you really like this kind of content, feel free to join up. I have a lot of cool perks available at the moment and I'll be adding more as time goes on. Um, I only have one level right now, but I think that's pretty sufficient. And as time goes on, I might have more kind of premium things available. But for the time being, if you're not interested in becoming a member, I'd also appreciate a like and subscribe. I'm always trying to create new videos every week and trying lots of new different kinds of content all the time. So if you do like this kind of stuff, I'd really appreciate it. And let's continue on with the video. But let's get into the game here. So we're going to start with um, a number of these nations. Now, one thing I should say is this game is much more difficult. Have you ever played any of the Democracy games, Democracy 3, Democracy 4? Uh, you notice that it's quite easy, to be honest. I mean, depending what your goals are, I guess it can be difficult. But you kind of make your own difficulty. If you're playing a nation like uh, Canada or Germany in Democracy 3, for example, um, you don't have to do much to keep it in its current status of being quite happy and well-developed. I mean, this is just for the game itself. I'm not talking about real life. Real life Canada has its own problems. But like I said, um, you kind of have to actively make it shit if you want it to be, if you want it to be a, d a dump, like um, our great uh, leader has done in Canada quite well. But um, for these ones, you're dealing with, pro uh, with countries that already have quite a lot of problems. Um, some of them are quite um, easy, I should say, in that they're quite well developed and they're lacking a lot of the problems that the other nations have. For example, Mauritius is quite an easy nation, uh, I would say, in this game. Um, it's fairly well developed, it's quite equal, um, it has high literacy and so on. So you have quite an easier time dealing with a country like Mauritius than you do with a country like Senegal or Ghana who have a lot of other problems. Senegal is the poorest nation in this game and has very severe problems, which you'd have to deal with as the leader of the country. And there's a lot of uh, variety in between, including nations with a lot of sectarian problems, like Nigeria has big uh, sectarian issues between different um, groups of people, different religions and so on. Uh, you have nations like South Africa, which have similar big divides, uh, big uh, uh, cor lots of corruption and a lot of um, economic uh, inequality as well, which is something you have to deal with, but also a lot of benefits in that it, uh, South Africa has a big industry and pretty high literacy, at least at the time this game was made. I know um, from South African friends I have that South Africa has not been doing too well in recent decades. So I don't know. We'll see if they come out with Democracy 5 Africa or Democracy 4 Africa, <laughs> how uh, South Africa is faring in that game. But in this one, South Africa is probably one of the easier nations. I wouldn't say easier, but it is quite a big nation with a lot of different groups to deal with, so I wouldn't say it's easy, but it is easier compared to nations like Nigeria, which are quite difficult. Uh, but yeah, there's quite a variety of nations. I think the nations they chose are quite good. They give you a good um, selection of Africa in general, um, ranging from the north to the south, uh, east to west, and also ranging from a variety of different problems. I would have liked to have a few more nations available to give it more variety, but this is pretty good. Uh, but let's get into the game. 
Now, to begin with, I'm actually going to choose a random nation. I think that'll be kind of more fun. Um, one thing to say about this game is it's very difficult. Even the easy nations, like Tunisia, for example, is quite an easy nation. Tunisia is quite well developed and stable. Um, you tend to get assassinated quite a lot. Uh, I don't know what it is about this game, but they turned up these sash nations like really, really high. So even nations that really don't have a history of like political violence, especially in their modern history, uh, you'll get assassinated over like nothing. Like I was playing a game just recently before making this video as Tunisia, and I got assassinated by the Women's Liberation League for, for like no reason at all. Like I had so many women's rights things and they still killed me for like for like nothing. Kill me for like nothing. So you can get assassinated at the drop of a hat in this game. So it's, uh, I'm expecting that I probably won't just play as one nation throughout this video. I might play a few nations. So we're just going to pick one to start off with. I'm not going to be playing the same nation twice. Uh, let's just pick our first nation. If, it, if we last for a long time, then great. If we don't, then um, I'll come back here and pick a new nation. But let's see our first nation here. Shuffle a few times. What do we get? All right, and our new first nation looks to be Botswana. That's a pretty good nation to start off with. It's not too poor, um, like maybe Senegal. It doesn't have the same problems as maybe um, Ghana or Kenya. And it's quite stable, quite well-developed, has a good uh, GDP and so on, good amount of GDP growth. So this is a pretty good nation to start with. We'll start with Botswana. Let's remove it from the list because next time, if I end up getting assassinated, I'll play something else. But let's start as Botswana then. So you can see they have a lot of information. It's got a very small population. It's not too many people to deal with. Um, GDP per capita is quite good. 16,000 is quite high compared to a lot of nations here. Um, it's higher than most of these nations, I think, except for Mauritius, I think is the only one higher. Yeah, I think Mauritius is the only nation higher than Botswana. This is per capita, of course. Botswana is a pretty small country, only about less than 2 million people as of 2015 here. Uh, Mauritius is even smaller, but Mauritius is also much more developed. Um, you know, still getting some foreign aid, which we want to get off that. Um, it's got pretty high uh, human development, which is nice. Democracy score is pretty high. I mean, Botswana has been um, a continuous stable democracy since it was achieved independence. So that's quite good. You get a little bit of history about the country as well. So Botswana is a good country to start with. It does have problems, mainly... Um, you obviously want to continue economic growth. You want to expand literacy and so on. So let's just get started. Uh, we're going to keep things pretty standard. Two terms, five years per term. And let's name our party as well. The Popular People's Populist Party of um, Botswana. <laughs> and what's the opposition party? I don't know. We'll pick an opposition party. How about the... Um, spiritual democrat party that's kind of funny so we'll keep everything kind of standard i'll keep everything as it is here i'm not going to change anything so five-year terms and two term limit all right so i'm not going to be doing anything too dictatorial here i do want to try to maintain the country as a fairly liberal democracy i'm going to try to do my best in government and we'll see if i get killed so you can see the problems here um, unemployment is a little bit high education is um, I guess this means education is okay, kind of middling. Poverty is, again, I want to bring that down. Crime is quite low, which is good. Health is low, which is not good. And GDP is quite low, which is also not good. So GDP is our biggest problem, I think. Um, bringing up the health as well is good. And then improving everything in general, lowering poverty. So I'm going to be trying to play this game as a fairly liberal president. Um, I want to focus on the economy. I want to make this country great <laughs> and um, just try to improve things in general so we got a few things that are problems here all these red circles are just general problems that we have to deal with all these green things are just kind of boons we have that we don't really get to in control we have endangered species that are good for tourism we have natural wonders which is good for tourism we have um, stock exchange which is nice uh, we have a few things good. And the blue things are just uh, general features of the nation, like the price of oil, air travel, and so on. And when I highlight, when I hover over something, it tells me what affects this. So for example, um, let's go to GDP. A lot of things affect GDP. Tons of things do. The things with green arrows are positive effects. Things with red arrows are negative effects. But sometimes the green arrows are bad. It just means that it's affecting it. It's making whatever that is, it's making it go up. And the red means whatever it is, making it go down. So things that are making my GDP go down, immigration, I guess that means immigration away from Botswana. Skill shortage is making GDP go down. Uncompetitive economy, corporate tax, petrol taxes, 
um, lack of technology and so on. All these things are bringing our GDP down. We have a problem with crime, which we want to deal with as well. So let's do our first thing first. First thing first, I want to get my cabinet. Let's take a look at who our cabinet is. So they're all pretty crap, looks like. This guy's not too bad. Hmm. Okay, so my transport and public service people are a little bit um, okay. Their other guys are really terrible. They're all no experience, low effectiveness. That means I'm going to be getting not much uh, political capital from them, I think. So let's see who I can replace with these guys. Hmm. I'm going to check out my economy minister. Let's see who else can replace him. Let's see if we can have someone here. Good loyalty is loyalty is important too, but I also want some decent experience. Looks like nobody has much experience here. And also want someone giving more political capital. This guy's giving me 3.9. And who can give me more than that? Who has also decent experience? I do want as much political capital as possible, but I shouldn't fire too many ministers because if I do, I'm going to have problems with uh, my experience, with my political capital long term. So maybe I could replace him with one of these guys. Let's replace him with this guy. He's got a little bit more experience. Um, he's pretty loyal and he gives me a lot of political capital. So let's go for this guy. Uh, Kologo Smith. So unfortunately, this guy, I'm going to fire him. And oh, that was my foreign policy. Uh oh, I didn't want to replace him. Oops. I thought I should hire somebody. Let's hire someone for um, foreign policy. Who can do foreign policy? Shit. I fired the wrong guy. <laughs> foreign policy. Foreign policy. Who wants to do foreign policy? This guy. Okay, let's get this guy. Uh, this guy sucks, but whatever, you know. This guy's good, actually. Let's get this guy. Liberals love him. And economy I wanted to uh, get rid of. Let's get this guy. And we will hire someone else for economy. Who might want to work in the economy? Let's get this guy, or one of these guys who has a lot of political capital. Oh, let's get this guy. Good with parents and religious. Let's hire him. Okay, that's good. I don't want to fire too many people. I'm going to lose a lot of my political capital. So let's just leave it at that. Hopefully that'll be okay. My political capital going down. Uh, let's see what we can do here. So what can we do? First, we need to get our money in order we're spending way more than we have we have a big deficit which is bad uh we just deal with the taxes now what i want to do is lower my taxes in the short term our debt is not too bad but our economy is not that strong so let's see here what things are affecting our gdp let's lower the corporate tax a little bit now this is a big uh, boon for our economy but i do want to promote um promote business. So I'm actually going to lower the corporate tax to about 10%. Let's do that. Uh, game hunting restrictions, income tax, leave all that, smoking tax, inheritance tax, sales tax. Mm, we may need some more taxes. Let's see. I do need more income. Enterprise investment scheme. Actually, I'm going to go with this. So not less about taxes, but more investment. This will help boost our GDP long term. Uh, this will make the capitalists happy, make the socialists upset. But generally, this is great for the whole country. It just promotes um, more investment. And so even though it's quite expensive, it's not that expensive. And it's really good for our economy long term. So I'm going to do that now because I'd rather get that going for the time being. Uh, right now, I don't have much political capital yet to do much of anything, to be honest. Yeah, I can't really do much. I would like to get my crime issue in order. Let's see, uh, anything else I can put in very quickly? Something very easy. Agro-dealer networks. Let's do this. This is also quite useful. It's very cheap and it's great for our agriculture. Just great for anything. Rural income, agricultural efficiency, that's all great things. So let's do that. And that'll be good for our first um, month, I guess. Now let's see who's unhappy in our country. You do have to keep track of this because these guys who are unhappy, they're very quick to just kill you for no reason. And to be honest, sometimes I find the people who are the most unhappy, they tend to not be the ones that kill you. Like I said, I had the woman kill me in the last game and they were like kind of just like average. They're just a little bit grumpy and they decide to kill me. Class warfare is a big problem. A lot of issues with that. So we got to deal with that as well. A lot of things causing that. Making everybody unhappy, to be honest. Malaria too, homelessness, a lot of problems in this country. Let's continue on. Banana Republic. 
Okay, so we basically rely on one thing as our whole uh, economy, which is not great. Let's see, public smoking ban. Ban public smoking or leave law unchanged. Um, I don't know. It would be help our health. Our health is a big problem. Let's ban public smoking. I do want to help the health of the country. I'm going to be a bit of a liberal for this, even though I don't really agree with that in general. Okay, rural alliance. Uh-oh. Rural alliance and women. Women are such a fucking pain. Like, geez, women always like want to kill me for no reason. I do want to help the rural people, so let's help out the rural guys. Labor laws. Working week. Um, Pro-employer. Hmm. I just want to improve our GDP for the time being. Okay, and focus on economy, but we do need to get our expenditures down. Our deficit is growing bigger and bigger, and this is a big problem. Hmm, I could allow... How much would this allow? Income. Hmm, I don't know. I, it is banned. I wonder if I can increase fees. The thing is, though, banning somehow makes me more money, which I don't really get. Whatever. Let's uh, leave it at that. Let's see what else I can do to quickly get some money. Let's see if I can get any kind of tax policies. I can introduce a capital gains tax, which could give me a lot of money. Let's actually put this in. I'm going to put capital gains. It's going to make the capitalists mad, but I'll give them something to um, complement it a little bit. It would give me a big boost. 50% capital gains. That's pretty high. Let's just do 30%. And I'll apply it there. That's quite a lot of money. An extra billion. Social will be happy. Capitalists will be a little bit unhappy. Lower our GDP a little bit. But um, I do need the money, to be honest. And um, I'll make it up for the capitalists. I'll put something else for them. I did lower the corporate tax, which should make them happy. What else are they mad about? Like, they're mad about fucking everything. Sales tax, corporate tax, income tax, civil service, wage parity. Socialists love this. Capitalists hate it. I'll leave it as it is. I mean, maybe lower it a little bit like that. I don't have enough political capital anyways to do that. I have 12. Okay, what else can we do? Let's deal with our crime problem in the meantime. I'm going to increase the police budget. So everyone hates the police having guns. What else can I do for safety then? Law and order. Let's do community policing. That might help as well. It's expensive though. Well, I think it's worth doing it. Let's do that. That should help with crime. Bring crime down a little bit. It makes the liberals happy. Liberals are so pissed at me right now for fucking no reason. What do they want? Liberals want all the bad shit. They want like... Do, do I have child labor right now? Oh, I have child labor. Oops. They want no child labor. They want uh, drugs for everyone. They want alcohol for everyone. They don't want anything, everything that sucks they want. Which is stupid, to be honest. Liberals are such a pain in the ass, to be honest. I'm going to lower corporation tax just down to 5%. So I'm not making much money. I know I need to make money, but I do. if I improve my GDP, that'll make money. So lowering tax a little bit. And let's end the turn here. STD education. I guess that's good. I have a big AIDS problem. So let's do that. That's good. Uh, Rural Alliance. Okay. Rural Alliance is pissed. So uh, we got to do something for the rural guys. What can we do for them? I already have the agro-dealer networks. What what more do you want? Let's see what I can give them. Welfare. What will help rural people? What do they like? What do rural people want? Agricultural subsidies? Oh, that's going to be so expensive Like for that. That's like a billion. Organic farming subsidy. Okay, um, organic farming. Let's do that. That's pretty cheap and the uh, farmers like that. Let's do this. Farmers are going to be happy. Rural is going to be happy. They're going to make more money. And it's not very expensive, so we can do this. The only people who don't like it are capitalists, but like whatever. It's like barely touched, to be honest. Let's do that. That'll give rural people a lot of money, and um, hopefully it'll make them happy. My deficit's going down bit by bit, so we need to increase my income and hopefully lower expenditure as much as we can. I don't know what I'm spending so much on. Let's check out my cap uh, economy here. State schools and state health. Ooh, military too. Uh, let's lower the military costs. I don't know what we really need the military for. Let's just lower it a little bit. Patriots are going to be pissed. But um, let's lower it to um, maybe just reservists. That'll be okay. Oh, I can't. I don't have enough capital to lower it. 
So let's wait till maybe another term. What else can I cut? I need to cut something because state schools, can I lower state schools? No. State health? <laughs> I can't afford any of this. What about new taxes? Anything else I can do? Plastic bag tax, junk food tax, and uh, health food subsidies. Hmm. Uh, let's do a bag tax. Why not? Let's do that. That's good. Let's do maximum. Get some money. A little bit of money, but whatever. That's fine. Ban plastic bags. Sorry, buds. I know you love your plastic bags, but we're going to get rid of it. What else can we do? Race discrimination, telecommuting. Oh, this is good. Let's actually do this. This is a little bit expensive, but that's fine. This will help um, infrastructure in general. Okay. that's. I'm, I keep spending money. I keep saying I want to cut spending, but I keep spending money. <laughs> whatever. Let's go. And the turn. Aid to eradicate disease. Oh, that's good. We got some international aid. Still deficit. Okay, farmers, like, come on, buddy. God, what do you guys want? I need to get more things to um, to make these guys happy, to be honest. I, I guess these things help make it go down, which is good. Get more intelligence services and stuff to keep these guys under control. Now, what did I want to do last turn? I wanted to do something. I really forget what I was doing. Uh, let's see. Oh, yes. I was checking my income and uh, military spending. I'm going to lower my military spending because this is so much money. I know the Patriots are going to be pissed if I pull this down, but oh, my God, this is so much money. Let's put this down. Okay. Let me see how I can lower it just a little bit. Save like ugh, I wish I could just lower it to like nothing. Cause I, what do I need a military for? Uh, okay, maybe I can make it up to the Patriots in some other way. Like, hmm. Okay, let's lower it to just reservists. That's a lot, but okay, let's do that. That's good. I'll see if I can make it up to the Patriots in some other way. If I could do something else for them. What else do Patriots like? Let's do something racist. Patriots love racist stuff. So we'll find something. Oh, I don't even have political capital to do anything. But we'll look for something like racist next turn. That'll make them happy. That'll make them happy that we have no military. <laughs> All right, let's end the turn. That's it for now. Oil drilling. Oh, yes, I want to do that, please. Rural Alliance. Come on, guys. Okay, the women are getting happier. They're leaving this group. Um, Rural Alliance is still pissy. Like, what do, what do you guys want? My da I'm bringing the deficit down. Doing all these nice things. Let's uh, let's look for some racist policies to make the um, Patriots happy. Patriots seem to be okay. Who else is pissed off here? Rural people, I mean, they're getting a lot of good things, right? Hmm. What can we do about desertification? This is going down. Everything's going down. Everything's doing good. Like, what are you guys pissed off about? Child labor? Do they like that or not? Uh, maybe we should ban child labor. Oh, they love child labor. Shit. Real people love it. <laughs> and it makes our GDP go up, too. Maybe we should raise it. Yeah, let's uh, allow child labor. Like, that makes kind of everyone happy, except liberals. So let's do that. That's good. No, I think we shouldn't, right? That's, that's bad, isn't it? Real people don't seem to care. The poor and youth. Rural and poor don't like it, so... Uh, I guess we should ban it, but like, whatever. Okay, let's not do anything for now. We won't touch it for now. Let's see what else we could do to make these guys happy. What, what can we do to make the rural people happy? Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Um, female genital, genital mutilation ban. Um, this will make the women happy. Women are pretty grumpy at the moment, so let's um, just put this in. It's not very expensive, and it will make women and liberals a little bit happy, which will be nice for later so they don't come kill me. Again, I need to avoid getting killed. State health. What do we have for state health? Uh, I would like to improve that. State schools? Damn, we're investing a lot in education. Holy shit. It's expensive. Four billion for education? Bruh. That's a lot of money. Our income? Where's our income? Our income is kind of stagnant, but it's not going down, which is good. I do need it to go up, though, which is what I want. Uh, let's do some more community benefits. What can we do here? Foreign investor tax breaks, capital equipment subsidies. Now, this is expensive, but it's so useful for the economy. I wonder if I should go for it. Uh, 
It is very expensive. Maybe I will do something cheaper in the meantime, like tax shelters. Let's do this. Most people don't like it. Socialists hate it. It's good for GDP. It's good for everyone, except um, socialists and equality hate this a lot. Uh, okay, let's do um, high. Let's do high like that. That's pretty good. I'm going to implement tax shelters. That will help in invite rich people to the country and hopefully spur investments later. Uh-oh. Tired of serving government and may leave position. Uh-oh. Okay, he supports patriots and capitalists. So we need to make them happy. Land redistribution. Hmm. Inequality in our nation. There's been calls to redistribute land amongst our citizens. Current tenants will be outraged, having legitimate claims to the land they have been investing for generations. Though their tenancies started well before modern political form, injustice in the past should be corrected. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. It will threaten our country a lot. Uh, I'm not going to redistribute land. I think that's going to be a bad idea. It's going to make the socialists upset. Land army. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Look at all these guys. Jeez. These are all terrorist groups that popped up. That's bad. We need intelligence support. I'm losing everybody right now. Oh, boy. I'm going to get assassinated, aren't I? Security briefing. Uh, uh, law and order. Let's do something here. Prisoner tagging. What can I do here? I need some, like, good things. I don't have enough capital for any of these things. Uh, I need something to deal with this. Okay, I can't do many things here. Uh, I don't know. I'm pretty limited in what I can actually do. <laughs> Oh, shit. This is going to be a big problem, I think. Uh, I would like to do a bunch of things, but everybody's mad at me right now. Uh, okay, let's see. Race discrimination, prisoner tagging. Damn, nothing actually useful. Let's do this to make the farmers happy, but right now the Patriots and everybody's happy. So let's do something to make other people happy in the meantime. Let's make the capitalists and the Patriots happy. So first of all, foreign policy. Um, let's do maybe this. Import tariffs. Will that make the Patriots happy? Hmm. Capitalists a little bit happy. Patriots very happy. Let's just do medium right here. Make everyone else ha unhappy, but let's um, do this now. Make capitalists a little bit happy and patriots very happy. So hopefully that'll help me a little bit. Give me a little bit of money as well. Land army, I think, are patriots, right? And matriarchs are women. Warriors of Gaia are environmentalists and power to all, I think, are socialists. I'm not really sure. But that's a big problem. We got a lot of these terrorist groups here. Oh boy, what else can we do? Uh, what about Race Discrimination Act? Can I do that? Uh, I can't really do much. Let's end the turn then. Uh-oh. Feminist plot. Fucking, the feminists always. Why are the feminists always on my ass here? Satisfaction with your government policies among feminists, pushing more and more them to the matriarchs of justice. Oh, boy. But we ended homelessness. That's great. Crime is going down. Unemployment's going down. Nobel Peace Prize. Someone won Nobel Peace Prize. That's good. God. Land army are the farmers. Okay, so farmers are pissed off at me right now. But look, geez, the deficit is going down. Our economy is doing so good, guys. Come on. Give me a fucking break. <laughs> uh, okay, I need to help the women uh, and then the um, everybody else. Who else needs, needs help? Let's do something for the farmers. What do the farmers want, even? Food standards. Uh, shit. Farmers are going to come kill me. I can't even, I don't have enough political capital at the moment to do anything. <laughs> Free bus passes. Uh, small business grants, that would be nice too. A culture subsidies. Oh uh, boy, okay. Um, let's do this. I'm going to go a culture subsidies. It's expensive. But I kind of need the rural vote here. So rural people are going to be really happy by this. Let's just do a little bit. We'll do some, but that'll make them really happy. Hopefully that's enough to avoid me getting killed. I may be killed when I get end this turn here because the women are very unhappy and so are the farmers. 
Okay, who is she? Young people trade unionists are pissed off. We ended armed robbery, so crime is going down. Health is going up. Failed assassination attempt. Damn. Five armed women converging on the government headquarters. Fucking women at it again. What do women fucking want? Women are not even unhappy. Look at this. Gender inequality. Whatever. Shut up. Like, fucking shut up, bitch. <laughs> what the fuck do you want? What do you want from me? Like, okay, uh, what, what can we do for women? <sighs> what do women want? Women love abortions, right? Let's go give them abortions. Where's the abortion law? Somewhere here, right? Do we have like abortions? Okay, we allow abortions, right? Women love abortions. I can't even do anything with this anyway. So we already have abortions legal. So what are you pissed off about? What else can we do for women that women like? Uh, women like um, other things too. Women love abortions. That's the big thing for them. Um, what else do they like? Family planning. We could do this. Human rights. Taxes. Uh, public services, let's see. Anything for women specifically that make them not kill me? Okay, let's do um, family planning. I guess this, women like this, right? Yeah, women love that. Let's do this, this is good. It's not very expensive, we'll do this. So lower gender inequality, um, HIV AIDS, and make women women's happy. That's good, so let's do this. Oh boy, I'm gonna get killed next turn by the fucking woman. Everybody's happy too, look, everybody's so happy, except socialists. And um, everybody, like even women are not unhappy. Everybody hates me though, even though I'm doing great for the country. Our deficit is way down. When I when I became president of this fucking country, deficit was like like billions, many billions. Now it's down to three billion and our income keeps going up and up. Like we're only making progress here, people. Come on, give me a fucking break here. Let's do worker safety. This will make the socialists happy, I think. Yeah, let's uh, do this. This will be good. Just a little bit. It's not very expensive. Let's do that. Okay. Anything else I can do very quickly? Clean energy, race discrimination. Let's do this too. Why not? Everybody likes that. Minorities love that. Liberals love that. Everybody loves it. Let's do that. Very cheap too. Let's do that. Okay. <laughs> Everybody's happy. Let's end the turn. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Please don't kill me. <laughs> Oh, another assassination attempt. Again, the women. Women are coming to kill me. Out, the women are coming out of the woodworks to fucking murder me. Look, the country's doing so well, guys. Come on. Young people and capitalists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bruh, look at this. Look at them. Everybody wants to kill me. Land army. Everybody's going down, though. The people of Freedom League are what? What is Freedom League? I wish I could tell what these groups are. I don't know what, like, they're aligned to. Freedom League, I guess are like, uh, I don't know what they are. Revolutionary Army, I'm pretty sure is socialist. Freedom League, maybe like liberals, I don't know. Matrix of Justice is huge though, look at this. The women are going crazy to kill me. Women will kill you for like nothing. My, look, the deficit's going down too. Def our economy is doing so great. Like, look at the economy, guys, come on. Like, isn't that good for everybody? That's good for women too. You really have to kill me over this? Can I afford an abortion? Like, make everybody love abortion. I can't. I can't even do it. I don't have enough political capital. Give me a break, guys. Oh, boy. Okay. What can we do that women like? What do women like? I have to think about women all the time with this. Oh, uh, boy. Okay. What what can we do here? Intelligence services. I think we have to raise this, guys. We got to deal with this. I'm going to raise this up to maximum because we got to deal with the... Uh, we got to get the CIA. We got to get the GLOW. Glow joggers. <laughs> I'm not going to say that word. Glow, glow joggers in here. To deal with these women before they shoot me. They're trying to kill me. Every They're coming out of everywhere. Uh, let's do something for the socialists as well. Let's do rent control. Make socialists happy. Make capitalists pissed. Poor people happy and capitalist income. Let's just do a little bit. We'll do a little bit here. That's good. Just make the socialists a little bit happy. Everybody likes that anyway. It's a good idea. Okay, let's end the turn. Please do not kill me. Please, woman. Like, what do you want? Like, fucking gender inequality is not even a big deal. Like, come on, guys. You're getting happier anyways. Oh, boy. Focus group. What do they want exactly? Their approval is 51%. So what the heck do they even want? Okay, whatever. Let's end the turn. 
please, please don't kill me. I'm doing so good. If you just give me till the end of this term, I'm going to make this nation so good. We're going to make Botswana great, man. We're going to make it so good. Oh, another assassination attempt. A woman again, woman again coming for me. Bruh. Health is going down too. Employment's going down. Land Conservation Act. Economy is doing well. Our GDP is doing great. Debt is going up, which is bad. We need to deal with our debt. But, you know, um, we're going to get our deficit down. If we can get our deficit down, my political capital is going down too. God, we got to deal with these guys. God, look at these guys. Let's reshuffle the cabinet. Just get new people for everything, okay? All right, new cabinet. Hopefully this will help a lot. These guys are a little bit better. They're not that loyal though. Uh, but that's all our income, all our political capital. So I got to end the turn here. Capitalists are getting mad. I'm going to have to help them out. Socialists are actually being pretty happy. And women, come on guys. Can you give me a break with this? Family planning. You got family planning. That's great, right? What else do they fucking want here? Maternity leave? Okay, like I can give you more maternity leave. Give me like a minute. Give me like one more one more turn and I'll give you maternity leave, okay? Get all the maternity leave you want. You can go on maternity leave for a fucking year. Right? Let's just don't kill me, please. Oh no. No. Guys, come on. Bruh. <laughs> Women fucking hate me. What did, what did I ever do to you? I was the best guy. I was the best guy. Women are fucking coming out of the woodwork because they they can't have, like, abortions or whatever. Like, fuck off, guys. Come on. Jeez. I fix. I almost fixed the economy of this. God damn it. Fucking hell. <sighs> Bruh. These guys will kill you for nothing. Nothing. This will kill you for nothing. Like, everybody else doesn't even care. But the women... I always get killed by the women because they're such, like... They're so sensitive to, like, everything. They'll come murder you. This sucks. Okay, as you can see, um, <laughs> it's not that easy to play a nation. It's easy to get killed. So let's end there. <laughs> I'm not going to end the video, though. I'm going to do another nation. I might do two or three, depending how long it takes. Let's do another nation then, all right? All right, so let's pick our next nation. Shuffle these a bit. We'll see what other nation I get. We'll see if I can last a little bit longer. Uh, I think I'll do up to three nations, depending how long it takes for the second one. I might do three, but we'll see. What's our next nation going to be? Oh, going to be Kenya. Ooh, South Africa. That's an interesting one. All right. So South Africa. Let's cut that from here. All right, so South Africa is like the big boy nation in this game. Let's get started. Again, we'll leave everything the same. Let's do the EFF, the Economic Freedom Fighters. That's the opposition party, uh, one of the, commu the Communist Party in uh, South Africa, right? Let's do them. All right, here we go. The National Party and the Economic Freedom Fighters. So my last game, I tried to be very liberal. I tried to make everyone happy. And you could see I got paid. Um, the I paid the price for it. So I'm going to keep everything as standard here. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to be a little bit mean this time. I'm going to be a little bit rough. We're going to squeeze these groups, squeeze them hard. And then we can make South Africa great. All right, so a lot of problems, a lot of unemployment, a lot of crime. Health and GDP are bad. So let's get started. Ooh, We have a lot of money this time. We have a surplus, which is great. Um, a lot of debt, though, and a lot of political capital. Let's check our cabinet. Our cabinet's not bad. Let's keep them for now. I think I'm going to keep them. I'm not going to shuffle them around right now. Uh, let's deal with a few things. First of all, we have a few people upset in the country. Let's take a look at security. No security issues yet. Again, women are a big problem. Let's deal with the women issue. Uh, I could cut it in the bud. Who's pissed about everything? Gender inequality. I'm always mad about that. Like, for real. Uh, foreign intelligence interference, which is a problem. Let's deal with the intelligence services first. I'm going to bump this up. Let's deal with this first. Having a big spy agency is really helpful. Deal with all these problems uh, that we have coming around. Police force as well. 
uh, giving quite a bit of money for the police force. They'll bring down crime. I'm also going to give the police force guns, armed police. Okay, every officer armed. We already have a pretty strong police force. Uh, let's raise the income of the police force a little bit. Let's put it to high. And what else should we do? Let's implement some other things. Public services, law and order. Police drones. While I have a lot of political capital, a lot of money, I'm gonna put a few of these things here. So let's actually do police drones. It's not very popular, but um, I think this is a good idea. Everybody hates it, but only liberals hate it. Like, shut up liberals, you know? <laughs> Be quiet, liberals. <laughs> And last thing we'll do, let's, um, what else can we do? I'd like to cut the corporate tax if possible. That'd be great. And, um, well, let's see what other things we can do. Can we put anything else, other things in? Let's do uh, telecommuting, not bad. Let's do community policing. That's a good idea. All these things deal with the crime issue. All right, so let's end. Oh, I still have a little bit of capital left. What else can I do? Can I do anything else? Let's also do agro-dealer networks. This is really cheap. And this is a great kind of policy. Just basically positive for everybody. Anything else I can afford? All right, nothing. Let's just continue on next turn. Oil drilling. Yes, drill, baby, drill. Rural Alliance. The farmers are pissed. Okay. Women, farmers, and um, the conservatives. Traditional Value Alliance. I think it's conservatives. I wish it would tell you what group this is when I hover over them because I don't really know. But I'm pretty sure traditional values are like conservatives, but maybe Heritage Society is conservative. So I don't really know. I think Heritage Society is the Patriots. So I'm not really sure. Oh, wait, Patriots are Patriots. So who are um, traditional values? Maybe religious people? I don't know. Religious, are they mad? Where are they? Uh, I don't know. They seem fine. Oh, religious are pissed. Uh oh. I have abortions on demand, bro. Women are still pissed about this. Like, why? What the fuck do you want? You got unlimited abortions. Religious are pissed. I'm actually going to dump this. Fuck that. Let's put that down. Conservatives are mad. Let's actually do this because I care about the religious people more than I care about women. Women keep killing me. All right, let's do that. And what else can I do? Increase. Um, do we have drugs? Our drugs are outlawed, which is good. Uh, gated communities encouraged is not bad. Uh, this makes everybody mad, but I don't know. Maybe we should do this even more. It doesn't cost us anything. Let's keep the conservatives on our side. That's good. Uh, handgun laws. Hmm. Let's actually increase that. I can't increase it. Okay. So I don't have enough political capital to do that, but that's not a big deal. What else can we do? Improve infrastructure. We still have a surplus, but a very narrow surplus. I should try to focus a little bit more on the economy. Let's do some things to help our economy a little bit. Enterprise investment scheme. This is a great idea. Let's do this. Not too much money and it'll help our GDP, help everybody. Socials are pissed. Like for real, like investment is a big deal. What do you, what's the big problem with you? Let's do that. Okay, that's great. Smoking ban. Uh... Okay, yeah, that'll help the health. Rural Alliance. Okay, farmers getting pissy. Let's deal with them. What can we do to help the farmers? I, I Let's do some easy things. There's a few easy policies I could do to help farmers, I know. Agricultural subsidies, organic farming subsidy. This will be great. Let's do this. That'll make farmers have a lot of free time, uh, have a lot of good times. Uh, what else can we do? Let's do something else. Uh, let's make women happy. We'll put the genital mutilation ban. That'll be happy for them. It doesn't really cost us much and that'll make women like a little bit happy. So let's do that. What else can we do? I want to get change our tax rate a little bit. I'm actually going to reduce the corporate tax to hopefully invite more corporations here. Oh, I can't lower it. So maybe next turn I'll do it. What else can we do? Let's get some more policies for our economy. What else can we do for our economy here? Junk food tax? No, no one likes that. Plastic bag tax. Hybrid cars initiative. Hmm. Health food subsidy? No, let's not do any of this stuff like that. Anything like really cheap that I could do? Food standards? 
Nah, let's not do that. I want to make uh, farmers happy. Gender discrimination. Uh, freedom of information. Hmm. Let's do telecommuting. 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 Let's do this. Because this will be pretty cheap and this is pretty nice. Most people like this. Only the uh, car usage is not is a bit of a problem. But otherwise, this is fine. Let's do that. All right. Anything else I can do very quickly? Welfare. Food stamps. Who likes food stamps? Family planning. 85 billion. Holy shit, that's expensive. Welfare fraud department. Let's get this going. That'll be good. Make the poor pissy, but make everyone else happy. Get rid of these welfare cheats. These little cretins stealing from the nation. Okay, anything else I can do? I can't really afford anything else. Any other little policies I can implement? Clean energy? I mean, that's expensive a little bit. I'm going to go into deficit if I keep doing stuff like this. Uh, let's do uh, the race discrimination. Uh, let's not do that. <laughs> Uh, what can I do? Clean energy subsidies. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. That's not bad. Does it help? Yeah, let's do that. Makes them a little bit pissy. We'll just make it a little bit. Do a little bit. Just some subsidies. Okay, good. Let's end the turn here. Armed robbery. Yes. So our crime rate is going down, which is great. Unemployment is really high right now, which is bad. And we got some extremists here. Sacred Sword, the religious group. Communists, I think, and um, Land Army, the farmers. So these guys are being a big problem. We got to deal with that. So religious people are pissed, but they're getting happier now. What can we do? Uh, let's get rid of uh, gays. Let's do that. Let's um, lower this down. Make liberals mad, but whatever. Fuck them, you know? Let's ban being gay. I don't want to... Look how much money this costs anyways. Let's ban that. <laughs> Non-hetero illegal. <laughs> ban gays. That'll make the religious people happy. Look, they're so happy now. They're loving it. Bruh, look at that. Elderly conservatives. Everybody's happy. Just liberals. Like, fucking... Liberals want all the shitty stuff. Like, fucking liberals, you know? State employees. Hmm. We can increase prisons. Let's increase prisons a little bit. Basic provisions. That's good. Yeah, let's do that. And how can I deal with unemployment? Unemployment is a big issue. Obesity as well. Damn. Homelessness. Yeah, this is a big problem as well. Unemployment is a huge problem. Now, what can I do about this? Military spending. We don't spend much in the military. And I'm going to keep it at this. I don't want to spend a lot on the military. What else can I do for unemployment? Hmm, and this is feeding homelessness a lot. Wages, informal sector. Hmm. State health, state schools, prisons. What can I do? I could put all the unemployed people in prison. That'd be great. Uh, let's leave that as it is. I think that's fine. I'm getting, running a deficit now, which is not great. I need to somehow in, uh, manage my taxes a little bit better. Uh, let's actually increase capital gains tax. I'm going to put it to 20%. That'll give us a lot of income. Let's put a 30%. It doesn't affect anything that much, but it gives a lot of income. So let's do that. All right. And that's all my political income, but I'll deal with our deficit problem. Children's food. Yeah, let's regulate children's food. We got a big, we got all these little chubby kids. Let's deal with the chubby kid problems. And um, terrorists. Oh, the rural terrorists. Okay. Uh, how can we make rural people happy? We got a surplus now, which is great. All right, let's uh, do something for the rural rural people. Let's actually do biofuel subsidies. This is great. So farmers uh, can make money from that. Oil demand is great. So this is all great. Let's do this. This is worth it. Makes everybody happy and it reduces our reliance on oil. So let's do this. This is a great policy. Make rural people happy. Anything else that can make rural people happy. Let's do something else here. Food stamps. Ooh, expensive. A lot of these are really expensive. Human rights oversight. Let's do this. Agricultural land tenure. This is really cheap. And this will make agricultural uh, rural people really happy. So let's do that. Let's do this. This is great. Very cheap. And that'll make the rural folks happy. So let's do that. Everybody's doing pretty good. Everyone's very happy right now. That's pretty nice. Uh, who's mad? Women are getting pissy still. 
you know, they got, you got everything you want. You know, you got maternity leave. I can increase that later. I forgot about it. I'm sorry. We'll increase it next time. Homeless situation is over. That's great. Crime is at a low. Everything's doing good. STD education program. Yeah, let's do it. We got a big AIDS problem. So let's do that. Budget surplus. The hard left extremists. So, okay, we got revolutionary extremists. Everybody is going down, though. Um, all my kind of uh, public control policies are managing that quite well. AIDS is still a problem. Unemployment is still a problem. Yeah, still pretty high unemployment. But we can deal with that. Everybody's pretty happy in general. Rural people are getting happier and happier. All right, so let's um, see what else we can do for these people. What else can we do that's good? Now, socialists are pretty mad. What can we do to make socialists happy? Uh, we have a pretty decent little surplus. So what we might do, actually what I want to do is um, lower the corporation tax a bit. So I raise income tax, but I'm going to lower corporation tax to 15%. That'll hopefully help our GDP a little bit. All right, that'll be good. And the other thing I want to do was the woman's maternity leave. Let's do um, three quarters pay. So make most people happy. Let's do it maximum. Why not? Full paternity leave. Let's do full pay. That'll be good. There we go. Hmm. Uh, okay, let's do, let's do that. Full pay. That'll make everyone happy. There we go. Okay, that's pretty good. What else could we do? Hmm. Civil service wage parity. I can't really afford much else. Let's do something to make the socialists happy. Let's put in some rent controls. That's good. This is really cheap. And this will make socialists really happy. All right. So that's pretty good here. I don't know if I can do anything else this turn. So let's continue on. Yeah, let's continue on. That's pretty good. Protest march against gender inequality. Come on, guys. Bruh, I'm trying my best here. Revolutionary army are growing. So this is the only uh, protest group, I guess. Matrix of Justice are going down. Revolutionary army is going down too. I'm actually doing pretty well right now. Getting all the security stuff out of the way first really helps out. Financial services regulation, foreign investment. Let's do this. Let's actually make this maximum. This will be good. This will make the socialists happy, help the stock exchange, and help basically everything. So let's do that. It's very cheap as well. That's nice. I need to pay attention to what I'm actually doing here. Green energy subsidies. Uh, I don't know about this. Costs like nothing to lower. Energy efficiency, CO2 emissions. Actually, let's, let's raise it. It's not very expensive. Why not? And oh shit, my deficit is huge. Look at that, oh boy. Let's deal with that. Well, I don't have enough time this turn. Maybe next turn I can deal with it. Oh boy, that's a big problem. Let's end the turn then, we'll deal with the deficit next turn. Oh my God, the feminists again, come on guys. What is your problem? Foreign visit for schedule, uh, visit historic ally or build a new relationship? Let's do this. Visit a new country, get more economy coming in. Foreign intelligence, health has been better, GDP is doing better, employment is down, everything is good in the country. And the women are still mad. Like, come on, guys. What are they mad about? If the women kill me again, I'm going to go full, like, I'm going to go full, uh, what is it? What is that book that people are so pissy about, like, recently? I'm going to go full uh, Handmaiden's Tale in the next game. If women kill me again, I'm, I swear, I'm going to crush them. I'm going to crush them under my boot. <laughs> I'll be nice a little bit here. You got abortions. Like, everybody has abortions, right? There, let's get more abortions if you guys like. Will that make you guys happy? Uh, can I raise it? No. I can lower it. I can ban it. Right now, it's fine. Like, it doesn't even affect uh, that anyways. So, whatever. Uh, what, what's making gender inequality a big problem? Maternity leave? Dude, dude maternity leave is, like, maximum. Well, come on, guys. Uh, health, education, GDP, whatever. So, all these things are making maternity leave, gender inequality. Uh, you guys have, like, full maternity leave. What the fuck do you want? 
I can raise that even higher because it costs me nothing. Let's do that then. Oh boy, what a woman want. What a woman want here. You know what? Let's go for um, Law and Order. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's do this one. This is good for capitalists. This will make them happy. So they're less pissy at me. Help our technology. And um, what else can I do? Freedom of information. Uh, bag tax. Uh, I don't know. Family planning? I could do this. Women love family planning. Who hates it? Religious people? All right, let's do this. This will be cheap and this will hopefully make the woman happy. Let's end the turn then. Oh my God, the women are coming for me again. Bruh, for real. Oh my God, guys. Let's, I'm, I'm going crushing these guys. These guys are fucking crazy. I'm lowering political capital too. Oh boy, what do I have here? Legal aid, jury trial. No, I need the things that like crush these guys, like death penalty and stuff. Curfews, things like that. We need these ones. How much capital do I need for this? I have no idea. Damn, we need these things really bad. Legalized prostitution. That'll give the woman something to do so they won't complain to me so much. Like, what do women even want? Where are they? They're getting happier anyways. Like, you got everything you want, guys. Come on. Everything is good. Gender inequality, like, nothing. Whatever. Like, come on, guys. Give me a fucking break with this. Give me a break with this, guys. Come on. Education. What should we be doing with education then? Skill shortage. Oh, my God. Like, you guys, if I get killed by a woman again, I'm going to be so insane. Let's give um, university grants. That'll be good for people. Expensive. Let's do partial grants. That'll be at least a little bit affordable. Deficit's pretty low, but I need to get rid of it if I can. Uh, capital gains tax is quite high. I can lower this a little bit, or I can raise it a little bit. Let's raise it to 40%. Yeah, okay. That's okay. Income. Hmm. I can do this. I'll just leave it at that for now. What else can I do to make some money? <laughs> property tax? Property tax is really low. I could raise this. This will give me a lot of money. Just a little bit. Maybe next turn if I don't get assassinated. I'm going to get killed by the next turn. What can I do here? Can I do anything with the police? Let's raise the police um, budget as well to maximum. That'll get state employees. Bring down crime. Bring down corruption. Uh, bring down everything. So this is good. Okay. Hopefully that will stop. The police can shoot these women before they come attack me. Let's end the turn. Survivor. Yes. Keep dodging the failed assassination attempt again. Veteran freedom fighters win case. Great. And people love me. Look how much people love me. There, there are more than 50% of the people love me, which is excellent. Great. People love me here. Only the women hate me. And the women don't even hate me. They're just kind of like indifferent to me. But you know, indifference from a woman is just as bad as them hating you. So you got to be aware of that. Now, let's try to improve our economy a little bit. The woman will calm down later. Like, guys, come on, guys. You got to give me a fucking break here. What's my deficit right now? Three billion deficit. Uh, okay, what can we do here? Can I do any law and order? I can't really do much. I can do Gender Discrimination Act. Maybe let's just do this. This will make them happy. Oh, uh, boy. Okay, let's just do illegal equality. I don't want to do positive action. That's a little bit too much for me. I'm not really into that. There, that'll help with women. Make women calm down. Uh, what can we do? Who else is unhappy with me? Liberals. Liberals are always unhappy. Capitalists are unhappy too. So let's see what I can do with the capitalists. Uh, actually, what I wanted to do was uh, raise the property tax a little bit. I can't. I can lower it, but I can't raise it. I need more capital to raise it. Let's uh, raise. Um, give more guns to the police. Give them all submachine guns. That's a good idea. <laughs> Every police officer can have an MP5 to gun down any woman who dares, like, cross my path. <laughs> this is no longer, um, this is no longer a feminist nation. The, the incels have taken over. <laughs> I'm going to have to crush them if they keep trying to kill me. I'm going to ban abortion if they keep doing that. I'm going to go nuclear on them if they keep trying to kill me. All right. I don't think I can do anything else this turn. Let's end the turn then. 
Another assassination attempt from the woman again. Come on, guys. Give me a break. Oh, boy, guys. I'm doing well. My party is doing great. People love me. I'm going to get elected again. If I can make it to the end of my first term. I'm getting a surplus now. People love me. Women are just pissed as well. Like, guys, come on. Like, what should I do about this? Oh, they're just mad that conservatives and religious people exist? Like, come on, guys. Like, bruh, give me a break with this shit. Let's just, like, execute them for real. Do we even need women? <laughs> I don't even know if I should waste any more time, like, dealing with women here. Let's just ignore them, I guess. Let's get more um, law and order. Prisoner tagging. Let's do this. Liberals are pissed. Yeah, whatever. Let's shut up, liberals. Shut up, liberal. <laughs> uh, we'll put um, health food subsidies. Let's do this. This will help our obesity problem. That'll be great. Okay, that's good. Let's end the turn. Please don't kill me. Uh, please don't kill me. Oh, liberals. Oh, liberals are coming for me. They're going to come get me. Liberals hate guns, but they're going to take guns to come kill me. Unemployment is down, crime is down. Like, what the fuck do you want? Even the socialists are happy, guys. Liberals are such, like, weenies, to be honest. They have no policy beyond just dumb, dumb shit. Residential credit facilities. This is great. Look at this. Our economy is doing so well. GM food proposal. Hmm. Is this good? Is this good for farmers? Uh, yeah, let's get uh, GM foods. That's great. I like GM foods. I don't want to eat them, but I don't care about growing them like whatever got my political capital so low okay we gotta we gotta do something about this let's reshuffle the cabinet our our cabinet is a mess right now everybody hates me uh yeah let's reshuffle the whole cabinet here we gotta deal with this all right pretty good we got a big good team here okay let's see what else we can do anything i can do for security what can i do here we might have to do some, take some extreme actions here. I'm going to actually do something here. I'm going to lower the right to, we're going to take away the right to demonstration. This is going to make these guys mad, but um, that'll be good, you know. Uh, okay, yeah, let's get rid of this. No more right to, no more right to demonstration. Oh, I can't lower it, damn. I can raise it, that'll make liberals happy. Okay, let's uh, let's raise it, that'll make liberals happy. Liberals are just mad about everything, guys. Come on, guys. I should not even bother with the liberals. Let's please. I'm so popular. I'm so super popular. But I'm going to get killed anyways by women or liberals. Let's see how it goes. Liberal plot. Okay. Polling station withdrawal. Economic forecast. So our GDP is going up. Everything's doing great. Our economy is doing excellent. Matrix of justice. And then freedom league. The liberals and the women are pissed at me right now still everyone's unhappy because of this why everyone's so happy okay let's get rid of freedom of the press make everyone happy see if i get rid of freedom of the press everyone's gonna be happy so let's dump that no more press freedom uh maybe we should just cancel the policy to be honest why would i even bother with this uh what else should i get rid of right to demonstrate I can raise it. Okay, I raise it up. Copyright law. Okay, good. Abortions. Hmm. I have a little bit of political capital left. Let's do something for the economy, maybe. Worker safety. This might be good. This will make people happy. Yeah, let's do this. This will be nice with the trade unionists. Yeah, let's end the turn. I'll see if I die. Another assassination attempt by the liberals. Uh-oh. Liberals. Liberals. Liberals are getting mad. <laughs> okay. I got a lot of political capital now. Everybody's happy. Huge surplus. Look at this massive surplus. Our economy is booming. Like, fuck liberals. Fuck women. We're going to make South Africa great, you know? While I have a lot of political capital, I'm going to put in some more um, questionable... Uh, policing laws. 
Let's see, we have tasers, anti-corruption, corporal punishment use. Hmm, let's see. Racial profiling, that would be good. Legalized prostitution, wiretapping, internet censorship, gambling, CCTV cameras. Let's do this. This will be a good idea. Crime, liberals, eh, fuck liberals, you know? Let's put this. That's great. Anything else I can do for um, law and order? Transport. Let's also do uh, some bus subsidies, maybe. Fuel efficiency standards. Bus lanes. Yeah, this is a good idea as well. This will help. Just make motorists mad, but this is good for everybody. Let's do this. So we got bus lanes and we got uh, total national surveillance. Two good policies for our government. Another assassination attempt. Damn, I'm going to be dead soon. Like, what are liberals mad about? Come on, guys. Let's keep putting more law and order things on. Tasers. Hmm. Let's see. Racial profiling. Let's do this. Oop, make racial tension go up. Crime, violent crime, and liberals. It'll make them mad. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Let's do maximum. Maximum racial profiling. <laughs> and the turn there. Land acquisition scandal and another assassination attempt. Oh boy, they tried to bomb me. But people in the country love me. They love me. 80% of the country wants to vote for me. Okay, let's um, let's stop doing security things. Let's also help out the poor a little bit. Poor are having some problems. Uh, let's do maybe rural development grants. This will be a great idea. Not too expensive. And this will help our GDP, help the rural people, help the poor and everybody. And lower unemployment. Okay, that's good. That's a good policy. And what else did I want to do? I don't think I have much to do anything else. Game hunting? I can lower this. Okay, what can we do to make liberals happy? Liberals are mad about everything. Like, come on, guys. You guys are such, like... Come on. You guys are such a pain in the ass. We're going to have to just dismantle the government to deal with these liberals, to be honest. Prisoner tagging, that's great. Oh yeah, I banned gays, that was one thing. <laughs> Press freedom, and oh, I know what I could do. I made cannabis legal, didn't I? Did I make it legal? Oh, I didn't. Well, I'd like to, le I'll legalize drugs, legalize weed, and then I can charge people for it as well. That'll be a good idea. Let's see what we can do. What else can we do for liberals? CCTV cameras, police force, policing, intelligence services, prisons. Let's do something to help the poor a little bit. I'm going to introduce food stamps. That'll help the poor, make them pretty happy. Uh, we'll just make it pretty medium. I don't want to spend too much money on it, but this is pretty good. It'll make everybody happy, lower poverty. That's good. Well, let's end the turn here. I may die this turn. Liberals again. Offer to build a national monument. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, liberals, liberals, liberals. Liberals are so pissed and so are women. Their membership is going down though. They're losing all their members because a country is so great that no one wants to be associated with them. Let's see if we can get some good economy standards on. Let's do a capital equipment subsidies. This is a great policy. Now it's very expensive, 105 billion a quarter. But this is excellent for our economy. Amazing for our GDP. I'm actually going to go maximum with this. Even if it costs a ton of money, I think it's worth it, to be honest. What else can we do? Uh, nature conservation. Let's do some more for our economy here. Let's also do tax shelters. That might make the socialists um, upset a little bit, but I think that's a good idea anyways. It'll help these guys. Lower quality, whatever. Let's do that. Boost our GDP. And how about small business grants? That'll be a good idea. Yeah, this is good. This will also help our GDP a little bit. Now, this is going to be pretty expensive, all these policies, but it should help our economy in the long run. Credit rating downgraded. Oh, boy. Ugh. Yeah, so extremist groups are going down. Everybody loves us. Our deficit is huge now. 97 billion deficit. But our GDP should start growing because of that stuff. Here, what I might do is to raise property tax a little bit. This hopefully will make up some of that. Let's do um, 40%. No, that's a lot. Let's do 25%. 
Extra nine billion per quarter. All right, get a little bit more property tax. I'm also gonna raise capital gains to 50%. There, so easy come, easy go. We'll kind of balance things out a little bit. Let's put a plastic bag tax, that could be good. Maximum, let's do that, good. Give us a little bit more money. We still have a big deficit, but we'll work that down. Opposition form coalition, all right. Deficit of 70, and our GDP is growing, which is good. I think, right? That means it's good, right? I think it means our GDP is growing. <laughs> we got to deal with this deficit problem, though. So let's see what else we can do for the economy. Technology grants. All these things would be great. But um, hmm, I need to be able to cut some money. Foreign language curriculum, international lecture observers. Let's see what else we can do here. Let's see if we can do something very cheap. Like adult education, this is a good idea. This will help with everything. Okay, let's see what else we can do. Let's also raise some of these taxes up a little bit. Let's increase the um, tobacco tax. Actually, let's not. Let's not, because I don't want the tobacco usage to be so low. Hmm, what else can we do to make some money? I can raise sales tax. It's expensive, though. I don't know if I can afford it. That would help our um, issues with uh, our economy issues a little bit. Maybe next turn, depending on how things go. I might have to lower this. Five billion. Which one is the one I just put in place? That's real expensive. This one, the, uh, this is a lot, a hundred billion. Maybe let's lower that to just medium. Like it's good, but that's so expensive. So let's do that. I think we have to cut it because our deficit is so high. That's like insane right now. To make up for it, let's do maybe something like... Um, let's do the open plan government offices. This is really cheap and this will help lower corruption and help the liberals feel a little bit happier. All right, let's end the turn. Litigation movement. Harboring this revolution, our relations will sour with our international neighbor. Uh, no, I don't give a shit about undercrowned country. Let's deny. Yeah, fuck them. All right, so things are doing pretty good. Nobody wants to kill me yet. So I might be able to survive to the next election. Next election's coming up very soon. Everyone's happy except for liberals. Liberals are always unhappy. But if I can just eliminate them entirely, that'd be excellent, you know? Okay, what else can we do here? What did I want to do last time? I remember I wanted to raise the sales tax, I think. Yeah, let's raise that to 25%, I think. That'll be good. Oh, I don't have enough political capital. 26 for that. Damn it, I have 22. Hmm, what else can I do to help the economy a little bit? Petrol tax. I can raise this. No, I can't afford to raise that. Damn, I can't afford to raise anything. Alcohol tax. Ah, okay. No, let's let's get that. What else can I afford here even? I can't raise any taxes, damn it. Can I raise property tax a little bit more. Let's raise it to 30% maybe. Capital gains already like maximum. Corporate tax is quite low. Okay, let's just end the turn here. I think it's going to be election time soon. Election results. Let's see. It's going to be a landslide. Look at this. Damn it. Wow, look at that. Brutal, brutal landslide. Landslide victory, electoral success, excellent. Our economy is doing amazing right now. Land redistribution, uh, no, I'm not going to do that. Mineral wealth. Our economy is doing really good. Expenditures going way down, incomes going way up. We're finally out of deficit. We're getting a surplus now. We can start paying down our debt if possible. Okay, what can we do here? 
Can I raise some of the taxes again? I do want to raise the sales tax. I can't afford it yet. Maybe soon I can. Let's also increase the university grants. I think that'll help as well. A little bit extra money. State Health Service, Legislative Independence. Let's deal with this little democracy problem. We don't need much democracy in this country. Let's dump this. <laughs> We're going to make South Africa a dictatorship. <laughs> okay, a lot of things here. What else can I really do here? I guess not much. Yeah, I can't do much now. Let's end the turn then. Technological advantage. Nice. Market meltdown. Oh, shit. Okay, big problem with our economy. We still have a surplus, though, and a big benefit, and now I can afford to raise my sales tax. It's a 25%. I think that's good. And to make up for it, I can do something nice for uh, the capitalists a little bit later. More subsidies for capital equipment. Let's do this instead. We'll reinvest the money into this. Let's make this from medium to high. That'd be good. All right, let's end the turn. Power block switch. Our store climate with the largest world powers in question. Their influence global pause. Global politics has waned with their economy. Now we have approached by their bitter rivals who seek an alliance. Uh, let's do that. You know what? That'll be good. Monitoring political support. Let's forge a new alliance. That's great. Yeah. Skill shortage at an end. Damn, our country is doing excellent right now. Human rights. Yeah, fuck human rights, you know? <laughs> like, for real, guys. Executive term length. Can I raise this? Uh, I don't have enough power yet to do it. Hmm. What else can I do to remove this whole democracy problem? I still have a surplus, a small surplus, but not too bad. Let's actually see what other policies I can do. You know what? This will be a good program. Space program, I think we have enough money in the budget for it. I'm going to implement this. Now, we'll do it pretty minimal. I don't want to spend too much. Uh, get some telescopes. Yeah, like this. About 10 billion big telescopes. That'll make people more patriotic, improve science and technology, which is great. Just basically a good thing. So we'll just start pretty small and I can raise this up later as I get more income. That's good. And what else can I do? I have a little bit of power left. Not much, right? One thing I wish about this game, I wish there was a way to see exactly what I could do. What decisions I can make. It's hard to see exactly where I can make a... Um, where I can make a decision because I don't really know. I have four political power at the moment. Some of these guys are giving me like nothing. Like this guy, public services. Let's fire this guy. Let's get someone else. Public services, public services. Who can do public services? Let's hire this guy. Okay, good. Makes other people pissy, but I guess we'll have to deal with it for now. They'll be happy later anyways. Everybody's pretty happy in the country. Just socialists are mad. <laughs> Socialists and liberals, but they're people I don't care about, you know? Obesity is still a big problem. State health service. Hmm, I could do this too. Let's actually do this. Uh, let's raise tax shelters to invite more people to the country. Oh, I don't have enough political capital. Whatever, let's end the turn. I think I'm out of political capital anyways. One party state. I've all but banished the other parties. Great, excellent. Foreign drug smuggler. Yeah, let's try them domestically. We're not going to send them abroad to be let go by those foreigners. Okay, 28. Let's uh, raise the chack shelters. That's what I want to do. Do maximum there. Oops. Yeah, make the socialists mad, but I don't care about them. The socialists as a group are getting pretty small. Smaller and smaller over time. What else can I do? I have a big surplus. Wow, huge surplus. Let's actually put that into um, capital equipment subsidies. That's just a great investment. And we can also do a little bit more for our space program. Let's go all the way up into unmanned probes. Oh, I don't have enough political capital. Maybe next turn. 
Hmm, what else can we manage? Let's do some more economic policy. Something might help us a little bit. Technology grants. I think we can afford this. Yeah, this is good. Let's go for maximum for this. I think we can afford it. Anything else we can do? Maybe you can do some pollution controls too. I think we have enough money for it. It's very cheap. And this will basically help our environment from being too um, disastrous. We do have this asthma problem due to environmental issues. So let's end the turn there. Oh, liberals again. Come on, guys. Refugee crisis. Ugh. Refugee is disgusting. Okay. GDP going up. Everything's good in this country. South Africa is becoming a very rich country. Huge surplus right now. Income is crazy high. I think I could put more into our space program. Let's get to unmanned probes. Yeah, that's what I want to do before. That's great. And if I could just remove these pesky term limits and write demonstration. Yeah, we can get rid of these things. And you know what? Deal with the obesity. Let's put a junk food tax. That'll be good. Nobody likes it, but that'll deal with our obesity quite a lot. And give us some nice income. So let's end the turn there. Full employment. Great. So we got rid of all the homeless. All the job seekers are gone. Calls to leave union. Uh, let's hold a referendum. Actually, you know what? Let's just make the decision ourselves. We're the leader of this country. We should make the decision. Fuck democracy, you know? <laughs> I'm being very authoritarian because I think that's kind of how I have to run this game. Like, you just can't really tolerate independence. Let's lower this to zero. Yeah. We're doing away with democracy here. Yeah, let's get rid of this. Apply changes. Good. All right. So we're, we're getting rid of all these democratic policies because we really don't need it. <laughs> Right demonstration is something else I would like to lower as well. We'll lower this to zero. So you're not allowed to demonstrate anymore. You're not allowed to do anything. Public services. I'm a very kind uh, uh, autocrat though. I mean, we're giving out a lot of good things for everybody. School vouchers. Let's do this. Everybody can get some schooling. There we go. That's nice. Still a big surplus, too. We can probably afford to do a little bit more, but we're out of political capital. Let's move on, then. Liberals again. Come on. Squatters' rights. No, fuck squatters. Out of here. No squatters' rights for that. <laughs> I'm a very pro-capitalist. I'm like a capitalist uh, autocrat kind of playing at the moment. Okay, what else did I want to do? I wanted to ban uh, freedom of demonstration. That's what I want to do. Yeah, let's dump this. Banned. Out of here, bud. And what else do I want to do? I also want to, um, the education. What was the other thing I want to do? I wanted to also, uh, get the voting rights. If I could raise this, that'd be great. So executive term length and, um, term limit. I love it if you do unlimited, but I need so much political power. That's going to be really difficult. But let's see, at least if I can make it to the end of this term, I'll be very happy with that. All right, let's see what else we can do for this. Let's get a little bit of welfare. We'll do some state housing. I think this is a good idea to get some money for people. They'll be pretty happy with that. Nature conservation. People like this as well. Maybe let's do this. People like this one. Make everybody happy except the capitalists. But capitalists are already pretty happy. So let's do this. Capitalists are already pretty happy. So that'll be nice for them. Liberals again. Credit rating upgraded. Excellent. And opposition members persecuted. Like I care. Get the fuck out of our country. We don't need opposition. Uh, Freedom League. Liberals are getting pissy again. Getting a lot of power here. We might be able to do some crazy stuff. Let's see what I can do. Law and order. I can legalize gambling. Corporal punishment use. Anti-corruption agency. Wiretapping. Uh, internet censorship. Let's do wiretapping for the time being. Not many people like it. Internet censorship a little bit better. Hmm. The problem with this is it really pisses off everybody. It lowers our technology. Let's just do it a little bit. On police request, some sites blocked. All traffic monitored. Let's do um, some sites blocked. Yeah, let's do that. 
also going to do anything else here. Let's do something very cheap, like maybe free eye tests. That'll be good. Make the poor happy, socialists happy, things like that. That's great. All right, let's end the turn here. Divided society. Who says equality is a bad thing? You've driven a wedge the size of a football stadium between the haves and have-nots. <laughs> oh my god, assassination attempt. Okay, so the liberals are trying to kill me now. But our GDP, look at the GDP, guys. Come on. My political capital is so high. I could ban um, executive term limit. I'm so close to being able to have unlimited turns here. Okay, let's see. What else can I do here? We have a lot of political power at the moment. Let's see what we can do. Hmm, maybe we can like limit some of these things. Press freedom is already zero. Uh, what else do we have? Judicial independence is like zero. Uh, what else can I do? Police force is maximum. Gender discrimination. Hmm. I'll leave that as it is. Political power distribution, we have none. Uh, I think I have everything. Right to demonstration is already gone. Let's put more like policing. Torture, that's pretty good. I like torture. Let's do this. Torture use. <laughs> Everybody hates it. Damn. Let's do a little bit of torture. Conservatives kind of like it. Yeah, let's do medium right there. That's good. Okay, deal with these guys. Deal with these fools. Government code of conduct. Okay, let's do this. This would be good for corruption. And um, also make liberals a little bit happy. We're having a very strict, orderly, but autocratic government. Which is the best kind. Another assassination attempt. Bruh. But we ended obesity. And we have border tensions now. Oh, boy. We're going to need more military, I think. Let's start investing a little bit in the military because um, we're going to need that here. Let's go to well-trained. Yeah, let's go to this. Let's make Patriots happy. Yeah, this is good. Let's buff, buff up the military. Big investment in the military there. And let's actually improve infrastructure as well while we can. Actually, you know what? Instead of doing this, I'm going to invest a little bit more in the trains. That'll be a good idea. Transport. I haven't been done much for transport. Let's get some rail subsidies. That might be a good idea. National monorail. That's actually a great idea. Let's do this. This will be great. This will be great for the infrastructure. It's expensive, but not that expensive, I think. Let's actually do a few more transport things. Free bus passes, bus subsidies, subsidized school buses. Let's do free bus passes for the poor. That'll make the poor happy. And anything else for transport? Uh, let's do maybe youth club. That would be nice. Yeah, it's cheap and people like that. Lower crime. So this is good. Oh, opposition boycott election. Bruh, you're not even in contention anymore. Another assassination attempt. Bruh, shut up, idiot. We have a lot of political capital right now. Just a little bit more and I'd be able to um, ban democracy entirely, which is great, you know? Hmm, we already got a lot of internet censorship. Let's do some more kind of law and order things. Anti-corruption agency, wiretapping. Let's do this. This is important as well. Liberals down and crime. Yeah, get rid of liberals. Liberals are already pissed at me, so I don't give a shit about them at all. What else can I do? Freedom of thought and association. Oh, this I should lower. Yeah, I don't want this. Hmm. Maybe next turn I can lower it. Actually, you know what? What did I just uh, change? I changed... Um, geez, I forget what I even touched. <laughs> oh, I put wiretapping. Yeah, so let's... Um, cancel? No. 
Let's leave that. Okay, what else can we do in the meantime? Taxes, anything for the economy? Recycling, let's do a recycling plan. That'll be a good idea. Everybody loves that. And we can do some robotics research as well. This is pretty good. Makes trade unionists mad, but um, this is pretty good. Yeah, let's apply that. That's good. All right, let's end the turn here. Oh, no! Again! Bruh, bruh. Give me a fucking break with this. I made this country so great, and you betray me like this. Come on, guys. Oh, my God. Come on over here. Come on over here. No, you flipped me off. Come on, Tower. No, no, no. Come on. You're not an intellectual. You're a fake and a fraud. Oh, boy. I hate liberals. I hate women. <laughs> I'm turning into Donald Trump. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, I think I have time for maybe one more nation. We'll see how this goes. Like I said, I want to do maybe three. Let's pick one last nation here. Ooh, Nigeria. Ugh, that's hard, man. That's going to be rough. Okay, well, let's go. This will be my last nation here. Okay, Nigeria. Oh, boy. I'm going to die in like two seconds. Uh, well, let's go. Super high corruption, low literacy, uh, lots of inequality, low GDP. Very difficult country to play. Well, let's try our best. Term limit two, term length four. Okay. Let's just pick a, a, something like this. Let's do people's... I don't know how I should play this one. I mean, last time I was very authoritarian and it worked pretty well, but the liberals eventually got me. First time I was trying to be very open. I think I'm just going to try my best to, I don't know what I'm going to do here. <laughs> like you can't make everybody happy with this. I don't know what else to do about it. Let's just pick a party. I'm going to pick um, the Free Patriotic Union. That's a good one. All right, let's start here. Hmm. Very rough. High poverty, low education, low health, low GDP, high unemployment. Crime is moderate, but still a problem. A lot of problems here. Religious persecution, racial tension. Oh my God, so many things. Race riots. Bruh, this is rough. Female genital mutilation. And we got a surplus. That's the good thing, at least. So what can we do first? Hmm. I don't really care about democracy that much. Abortion, yeah. Oh, I'm going to get killed by women, like, immediately, I bet. Can I raise my term length? I can't. Can I increase this? No, I can't. I need a ton of political capital to do anything like this. Oh, boy. What should I do first? Let's do something with the economy first, I guess. Hmm. I wonder if we should ask for foreign aid. Now, this might make the... Um, do power block alignment. Let's do this, actually. This might be a good idea. Foreign relations, foreign investment, foreign aid. Makes liberals mad, makes patriots mad, but that's okay. Let's do this. That might help long term. Getting some foreign aid would be nice. I could ban female genital mutilation. Let's do this. That might make um, women a little bit happy, make everyone else unhappy. But let's do this. Heavily enforced. Not that expensive, and hopefully that'll make women happy with me. Let's also end racial discrimination. Not many people like that, but that'll hopefully relieve ethnic tension a little bit. Okay, let's end the turn. Please don't kill me within the first few turns. Educational failure. Oh, boy. I didn't do anything yet. Okay, yeah, ban public smoking. God, everybody's getting pissed already. Oh, boy, what a mess of a country. <laughs> Military spending is not that high. I can raise my term length. Maybe I should do this. I don't know. I think I'm going to leave it now. Leave it as it is. I do want to invest in other things. Let's do something for our economy. We have a big economic problems. Uh, religious people would like this. Rural development grants. Let's actually do this. This is a good idea. This will help the rural people a lot. Help our GDP. We have a nice little surplus. We do want to help our little peoples out. 
And uh, let's also do chack shelters. I think this is a good idea as well. This will make the socialists mad, but it'll help um, GDP and help introduce uh, some technology as well. Let's do community policing. This is pretty cheap. And that should help uh, with crime a little bit. All right, let's end the turn here, I think. Now we're gonna have a deficit, squatter's rights. Nah, no squatter's rights. I hate squatter's rights. Crime's going down, which is good. 40, not bad, so I still have a lot of political support. Uh, who do I have a lot of in my country? A lot of conservatives, a lot of rural people, a lot of socialists. So let's try to focus on these guys. These guys are the important ones. Uh, conservatives like a lot of things. Hmm. They don't like the female gen genital mutilation, but we can try to give them some things to make them a little bit happier. Let's um, maybe gated communities. They might like that. Let's get um, a few things here that are a little bit expensive. These are pretty expensive. Jeez. Intellectual property rights. Let's actually do this. This will be good. Makes the capitalists happy. Foreign relations. And gated communities. Let's do this as well. This will make conservatives very happy. Lower crime. Lower liberals. Lower quality. Everything I don't care about. Let's do that. Next one. Anything else I should do? Let's also do um, agricultural land tenure. I think this is pretty good. Let's do that. Makes conservatives a little bit mad, but it'll make the rural people happy, which is also good for me. All right, let's end the turn. Airplane crashes. Okay, not my fault. Okay, we can get unemployment. Let's bring unemployment down if we can. Whew, okay, what can we do? Hmm, agro dealer networks. Oh yeah, this is great. I want to get this. Economy, anything else for workers? What can I do for the workers here? State housing, unemployment, benefit? No, I don't want to do that. I have so many unemployed here. It's crazy, to be honest. Rent control, this might be a good idea. Food stamps. Let's do uh, rent controls, that's a good idea. Make capitalists pretty mad, but it'll help the poor and help the socialists. Let's do that. I'm gonna be very socialist this time. Childcare provision? Oh, that's so expensive, though. I need to do things cheap. Cheap things that help socialists, you know? Help socialists, help the economy. Let's um, do what we can. Maybe some small business grants. That'll be good. It's medium. All right, we're running a big deficit now. We're going to have to be very careful going forward. Let's get some taxes on here as well. Maybe luxury good tax? Ooh, I get a lot of money from that. 34 billion from this. Let's raise this to 65%, make the wealthy mad, but 50 billion is pretty good. That'll cover my deficit entirely. Any other taxes I could put on? Plastic bag tax, junk food tax, health subsidies, enterprise investment scheme. Maybe later I'll do that. Let's do the plastic bag tax. We'll make that maximum. Let's do telecommuting, because that's also good. It's expensive, but whatever, that's good. Let's end the turn here. HIV AIDS is over. We ended AIDS, guys. We cured AIDS. Foreign military training. Yeah, let's do that. Patriots will be mad, but I mean, it's good for us. Socialists are going to be very happy. We're putting a lot of things for socialists in in, in place. Let's also um, give us some better uh, labor rights here. Pro-union. I'm going to be very pro-union here. Let's also do a, a junk food tax. This will be a good idea. Okay, let's end the turn here. Socialists are mad, bro. I'm doing everything I can for you guys. Oil drilling, let's do that, yeah. God, the socialists are gonna kill me now? Come on, I'm trying to help you guys here. Look at all these good things. Look at all these good things for you. You guys are really pissed at me? <sighs> How many other things do I need for you guys to be happy with this? Mansion tax, let's do this. Make socialists happy, give us another 67 billion Already six billion positive. So we're getting a decent little income. Polling station withdrawal and failed assassination attempt. Jeez, I'm already getting assassinated by the socialists here. Come on guys, I'm trying to help you out. Okay, I need to get some more security though. Let's go for the um, intelligence. Okay, fully armed police. 
let's get the intelligence services um, up a little bit more. We have a huge surplus, so we can afford it. And what else should we do? Minority sexualities is already banned. Uh, handgun laws. I could have total handguns allowed, which is great, but I can't afford it anyways. What else can I do? I can ban. Uh, let's ban right to demonstration. We don't need this. This will remove race rights, hopefully. Hmm. Let's do something here. Let's raise the alcohol bans as well. This will hopefully lower crime. Let's do open plan government offices. This is good. This will hopefully lower corruption. All right, let's end the turn. Oh, another assassination attempt from the Socialist Army. Oh my God, guys. Guys, give me a break with this. Socialist, why are you so mad? Tax shelters. They don't like tax shelters. Really don't like it. Okay, maybe I should cancel this. Let's just cancel that. Hmm. Oh boy. Okay. Taxes, 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 everything. Let's do enterprise investment. This is a good idea. Help our GDP. We have a big surplus anyways. Next turn. Agrarian society. Who needs cities anyways when you have everyone farming? Yeah. Race riots are over. Great. And another assassination attempt. Holy shit. I, this, this is going to be my shortest game yet. <laughs> okay. Let's see what I can do to make some money here. Let's raise the toll roads a little bit. Abortion is allowed. Okay. I can ban abortion. That might help these guys. You know, let's do this. It'll help make the conservatives happy and reduce gender inequality or increase it, but I don't care about that. So whatever. That's good. Feminists, uh-oh, feminists are mad. I threatened to take away abortion. What? They're charging me with stuff? Bruh. Oh my god, oh my god, look at this. I think this can be a very short game, guys. <laughs> oh no. Uh, what can I do? Let's legalize child labor, why not? Why not do it? I'm going, I'm going balls to the wall right now. Law and order, uh, gender discrimination. Let's, um, nobody likes that anyways. Biofuel, let's do this. Farmers love biofuel. And food stamps, can I afford that? Welfare fraud department. Food stamps, let's do some cheap food stamps. Low, but that's good, better than nothing. 14 billion, I think we can afford that. Another assassination attempt. And we have brain drain now, which is a big issue. Uh, all these taxes are too much for these guys. Oh, boy. Okay. Poverty is going down, at least. We still have a surplus. Okay, what can I do about this? Hmm. The money from these things is so useful, though. I think what I'll do is I'm going to lower corporate taxes. 20%. And um, what else could I show lower? Maybe capital gains. Let's actually raise capital gains. That'll be a good idea. That'll get me some good money to offset this. And the other one, what was the other one that they're pissed about? The luxury goods tax. Okay, so let's uh, lower this then. This is a 20%. So I'm getting some money from it, but we're lessening the brain drain because our brain drain is so high right now. Uh, maybe I'll cancel this actually. Let's scrap this. That's your good tax. I'm going to lose a lot of money from that, but we'll see how it goes. I can find another way to make money. Let's do family planning. That'll be good. Just a little bit. I'm not going to spend too much on it. Okay, let's end the turn here. Oh, again. The woman got me again. Bruh, I did nothing. I literally changed the abortion law. <laughs> Like a little bit and they immediately killed me, bruh, for real. And you know what? It took the liberals like years to kill me. The woman get me immediately. Oh boy. You know, that's Democracy 3 Africa. Um, you know, stay away from women. That's the number one African rule I can tell you guys. <laughs> Beware of women, you know. But either way, yeah, that's Democracy 3 Africa. This is, um, would I recommend this game? I mean, I don't know. It's, it's kind of funny. But it's a little bit overpriced for what it is. You can see it's kind of like barely a game. But it is kind of 
fun. I mean, um, I do wish Democracy 4 was a little bit better. I wish they could improve it and make it more engaging and also add more variety of nations. So it's not just the same kind of handful of like wealthy, stable nations. I do like having these more unstable nations, but the rate of assassinations you get with this game is insane, dudes. Like, come on. I was doing so good in that South Africa game and they still killed me for like, for nothing, dude, for nothing. You killed me for, bruh, sucks to be honest. Either way, guys, I'm going to end the video here and I'll see you again next time. So goodbye, my brothers. Take care of yourselves.